Hey everybody, Twain with Neutrina. Let's talk a little bit about your chicken coops and how to keep them safe. This is pretty critical, okay? The chicken coop is gonna be the biggest outlay of money in this hobby for you. So I recommend spend the money, get a nice chicken coop. The main thing is, is it needs to be predator safe. One of the biggest misnomers in this hobby is a thing called chicken wire. Chicken wire keeps chickens in, but it does not keep predators out. Here in the Midwest, the raccoon is public enemy number one. What they do is they take their nasty little jazz hands and they can stick it right through chicken wire, grab your chicken by the throat, and they try to pull them through. They get frustrated. They don't just kill one, they kill all the witnesses. So one bad night, and you can lose your whole flock to a raccoon or a group of raccoons because they do travel around in groups. So what is the answer? Make sure your coop is wired with hardware cloth little squares and the raccoon cannot put his little hands through there and make sure if you're doing it yourself you use those little u-shaped nails don't use staples staples a raccoon can grab a hold of that wire and peel it open you want to make sure you use a little bit heavier duty wood too some of these kits i've seen they're real real lightweight it may not be a safety issue so much as you're not going to get that many years out of it so you're better off, in my opinion, to spend more money, get a heavier duty coop that's predator safe. Now, you need to make sure they're buttoned up at night every single night. You gotta make sure the coop door is closed. If you leave it open just one night, you can lose all your chickens. So they even make solar powered automatic coop door closers. I don't have any vested interest in those. They're available and that's why. It's very important you button them up at night. Your coop is where the chickens sleep at night. The run is attached to it. And usually the run is more or less four posts, wire, and a roof. Now this is very important. You need a roof on that run or you'll get hawks and maybe things like coyotes and foxes in there. So really think this out. Make sure it's predator safe. Some people use motion sensor lights, things like that to help. There you have it, folks. We hope you've learned something new, and be sure to check out NutrinaPoultryFeed.com to find the feed that's right for your flock.